Hello everyone and welcome to another at Maths tutorial video. Now I'll be discussing Form 5 Additional Mathematics Chapter 2 Differentiation Long Question Example 2. Okay, before that, please like this video to show your support and subscribe to the channel for more upcoming mathematics tutorial videos in the future. Okay, let me read the question now. Find the first derivative of y equals to 2x square plus 3 from first principles. So this is the overall question. So I hope that you will attempt this question in the future. If you could manage to solve this question, a big thumbs up to you guys. But if you can't solve this question, no worries. I'm going to show you the step by step working and the solutions. So without further delay, let us start to solve the question now. Okay. To find the differentiation using the usual method, it will only take you one step. But then in this question, they ask you to use the first principles method. Okay, so if you guys don't know what is the first principles method, don't worry. I'm going to uh, explain to you detail by detail now using this question. Okay, so to use the first principle, okay, let me write this whole equation here. Y equals to 2x square plus with 3. Okay, let me label this as the equation number 1. Okay, so for the next step, what you're going to do is for the y, we're going to add with delta y. So it will become y plus delta y. So as for the x, which is in the right hand side, we're going to use the similar concept, which is x plus with delta x. Okay, so let us continue with our working. So for the left hand side, you just have to add with delta y. Okay, y plus with delta y. Okay, for your information, delta y means small change of y, guys. Okay, delta x means small change of x. Okay, so y plus delta y is equals to 2 in a bracket x plus with delta x square plus with 3. Okay, so you expand this bracket. So from here, you should get y plus with delta y equals to 2 in a bracket x square plus 2x delta x plus with delta x square plus with 3. Okay, so you expand the 2 inside the bracket. So from here, you should get y plus with delta y is equals to 2x square plus 4x delta x plus 2 delta x square plus with 3. Okay, so this will be your second equation guys. Okay, let me label this whole equation as equation number 2. So I hope you understand the working till now. So for the next step, what you're going to do is this equation 2, you minus with the equation number 1. So what you're going to do is this equation 2, we're going to minus with the equation 1 over here. Okay, let me write in the working here. Equation 2 minus with equation 1. So from here, we start with the left hand side. So y plus delta y, you minus with y, you only left with delta y. Okay. So delta y equals 2. So let us proceed to the right hand side now. So the 2x square, you minus with 2x square, you left with 0. So you can ignore it. So the 3 and 3, you minus them. So you'll get 0 as well. So you only left with 4x delta x plus with 2 in a bracket delta x square. So from here, your right hand side will be 4x delta x plus with 2 in a bracket delta x square. Okay. So for the next step, what you're going to do is we're going to divide the whole equation by delta x. So when you divide the whole equation by delta x, so you're going to end up getting dy. Sorry, guys not dy it's delta y over delta x 
okay as you divide the whole equation by delta x so this is the left hand side of the equation where you have delta y over delta x and then as for the right hand side you will have 4x plus with 2 delta x okay the power of 2 will get reduced to 1 since you divide the whole equation by delta x so i hope you understand okay so for the next step what you're going to do is we're going to find dy dx by using delta y over delta x so how is it possible okay let me show you the working now so from here to find the dy dx dy over dx will be equals to limit of delta x approaches 0 with respect to delta y over delta x so this is the formula guys in order to find dy over dx using the first principle okay let me box this formula okay since in our working here we have already find delta y over delta x you just substitute this equation over here so from here dy over dx will be equals to limit of delta x approaches 0 okay from here 4x plus with 2 delta x so you substitute delta x with 0 from here your dy dx will be equals to 4x plus with 2 since your delta x you have already substituted with 0 so 2 you times with 0 so from here you should get your dy over dx is equals to 4x okay so this is your final answer guys okay let me underline the solution now okay we have already completed our differentiation using the first principle but some of the students still have the doubt whether your answer is correct or not so if you want to double check whether your answer is correct or not you can always check using the usual method okay y equals to 2x square plus with 3 so use the usual method dy over dx so the 2 you times in front you get 4 and the power of 2 you minus with 1 so from here you get the dy dx is equal to 4x okay simple as that so if it's the same means then your answer is correct guys okay so that is all for the step by step working and solution for this question i hope you understand the full working that i've shown to you if you like this video please give your thumbs up if you haven't subscribed to the channel please subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon for more upcoming mathematics tutorial videos in the future and not to forget to share this video thank you everyone for your support and i'll see you in the next video